Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Stacy with Blondia Mexico and I am back doing a video on a new place that is opening up here in town. Today is friends and family night and tomorrow is gonna be the grand opening. So come check it out with me. This is the beer company in Roosevelt Plaza, or I should say a co-op, that has multiple different places like a cafe, a vegan restaurant, and now the beer company is here. So if you are somebody that enjoys a really good, tasty craft beer, this is a place you're gonna have to check out because there's well over 100 beers in this place on tap and in bottle. So you're gonna have to check this out because it's an experience that you're not gonna find anywhere else. Look how pretty this place is. Guys, check out all these different bottles of beers that we have by the bottle. I lived in Denver for a year and this kinda is bringing me back to my Denver time where I would go to the grocery store or go to the market and find so many different craft beers. Let's go see what we have on tap inside. Not sure what beer you want to try on tap? Try one of their flights. All right, guys, we are here with the owners of the beer company. We got Almendra and Tyler. So tell us a little about Hi. yourself. Hi. <laughs> Hi, people. Why? Why did we uh, start this company? What was our inspiration? Um, coming from California, which is basically the land of craft beer in the states, um, you can imagine that it was a pretty difficult transition to be in a place where everybody pretty much drinks mass-produced, low-quality beers, um, like certain beers that are from Mazatlan and certain beers that are not from Mazatlan but are equally terrible. Um, and we wanted to change the game, you know, do something a little different. There are some really great microbreweries here in town, um, but there are a lot of different breweries in Mexico um, that we wanted to be able to bring to Mazatlan because they're just impossible to get otherwise. Um, so that's pretty much what we've done. Um, right now we have about 150 different beers, um, bottled beers, and then rotating cast of taps. Um, we have eight taps right now with four different breweries, um, three of which are from Sinaloa and one of which is from Sonora. Does that, does that pretty much cover it? <laughs> Yeah. Uh, we're thinking about bringing some other breweries that are from Tijuana and Baja California. Uh, these breweries are like really, really talented microbreweries that we found um, like Wendland and Porter Psycho. And they are like providing for taps that we are, are thinking about bringing to Mazatlan too. Nice. So tell me more about the beer company. So you're not the first one. Correct. It's a chain. Um, there are, I think, 39 other locations throughout Mexico, um, but we are the first in Sinaloa. Um, and I think that we are the only one on the West Coast, right? Um, I don't think that there's one in Sinaloa. Yeah, we're the only yeah. one in Sinaloa for sure. So that's why we have to represent the whole state um, with the breweries from Culiacan that we have, uh, like NSR and, and uh, um, and I'm hoping that we'll have even more in the future. You know, there's other breweries that we want to get um, around the state. So. And well, I hope that you did visit us so you can see how we, all the hard work and heart that we have put into this project. Alright, so right now we are tasting a peanut butter, peanut butter stout. stout. From, from yes. Minnesota, based in Culiacan. Yes. It's a really good beer. Yes. So this is from Culiacan. Mm -hmm. Yes, this is from oh, Culiacan. Cheers. So, yes, cheers. Congratulations. 
thank you for letting me share another wonderful place here in Mazatlan, a beautiful city that we all love. And hopefully you can make it down here.